<laughs> oh boy. I'm so ready, apparently. Let's go do Wow, everybody's so fucking excited. Alrighty then, let's check the sound. As soon as we get some sound from this game. Alright. <clears throat> wow, you guys need to chill over there. Oh, that w Yes, this warning. This game is not suitable for children or those who are easily disturbed. I see. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Uh, individuals suffering from anxiety or depression may not have a safe experience playing this game. For content warnings, please visit... There's the webpage. I'm mad that it says, uh, Moe. <laughs> DDL... DDLC dot Moe slash warning dot HTML. <laughs> Listen, I normally you normally you don't get this warning for your like sexy sexy time video games, okay? So Alright, alright, okay. Clearly not gonna be too much of sexy sexy time, more like what the fuck time. Alright then. Mm, by playing Donkey Donkey Literature Club, you agree that you are at least thirteen years of age. I think yes, I think I am past that. So let's not make old jokes on the chat, please. Um, and you, you consent to your exposure of highly disturbing content. Alright, I, I'm gonna, I'm gonna hate you guys, right? That, that's what's gonna happen. I'm gonna hate all of you that suggested this game, isn't it? Maybe it's, maybe it brings back memories about high school girlfriends and stuff. Maybe you just want to slit your wrist against us. Oh my. Alright, good night. Okay, have a good night. Have fun, uh, Akari. Uh, let me agree to this shit. Oh boy. Alright, let's agree to it. Oh, it sounds so nice. Alright, good night. <laughs> Yeah, mm mm, yeah, mm, yeah, mm, yeah, mm, doki doki, mm, yeah, yeah, doki doki, mm, yeah, yeah, yeah. By my mixtape is fucking fire! <laughs> yeah, doki doki, mm, yeah, mm, doki doki, mm, mm, yeah. <laughs> Alright, listen, don't fight over it. Ryan and Mike, both of you wanted me to stream this, okay? <coughs> don't worry, I'll hate both of you equally. You don't have to fight over it. <laughs> you feel the press already? Come on, my mixtape would've helped with that, but no, oh, man. Alright, new game! Let's go! Please enter your name. Um... Uh... Mr... Okay, no, let's hold on. Um... Um... Uh... 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 No, hold on. I need a name! <laughs> I need a... A name that uh, brings my personality out. <coughs> You know what? Fuck it. Let's just do it. Whatever. If I want to get my fuck, I want the game to talk to me with my actual name. <laughs> All right. All right. I gotta make voices now. All right. I don't know who this person is, so I'm just gonna go with uh, monotone at this point. Hey. Okay. I see an annoying girl running. Oh, it's a girl. I see an annoying. Well, that 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 would have been death. That's your name, Lee. Yes, that is my name. Now everybody knows. Well, to be fair, everybody already knows. I see an annoying girl running towards me from the distance, waving her arms in the air like she's totally oblivious to any attention she might draw to herself. You know, this is a bad neighborhood. People get shanked all the time. She's just asking to get shot. 
That girl is Dayori, my neighbor and good friend since we were children. Hmm. All right. This ch uh, childhood friend. Got it. You know, uh, the kind of friends you never see yourself making today. You know, like the ones in anime. Right. But it's just kind of. Uh, but but it just kind of works out of because you, you, you know each other for so long and you know. All that sexual tension and shit, right? That was cool. <laughs> we used to walk to school together on days like this. But, st but starting around high school, she would oversleep more and more frequently. And I would get tired of waiting for this bitch. But if she's going to chase after me like this, I almost feel better off running away. So, bye, bitch! No, we're staying, we're staying. We're not, we're not like that. However, I just... Uh, uh, sigh and idle in front of her, uh, in front of the crosswalk, and let Sayori, 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 Sayori song catch up to me. Ah, ah, I overslept again. Why, why would I give her that voice though? <coughs> like, come on. Mm, you, what's your voice? I, oh, me, me, ma. <laughs> me, I. <laughs> all right, all right, I got it. I ever slip again. <laughs> there you go. I ever slip again. But I cut up. I I cut just. I bit that. <laughs> <laughs> I don't think I can keep this up. <laughs> I'll try though. But but I caught you this time. <laughs> Sayori, you klutz. <laughs> she sounds like a muppet. She might be. I don't know. Maybe. But only because- uh, Oh, that's me. <clears throat> Maybe, but only because I decided to stop and wait for you. Dummy. Um, to say that like you were thinking about ignoring me. Uh, the thought crossed my mind. That's mean, Luigi. Hey, 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 hey! Who told you to address me? By my first name, alright? I'm Cucumber. Let's go. Well, if people stare at you for acting weird, then I don't want them to think we're c a couple or something. You know? I mean, look at you. you know, and look at me. I mean, I'm just saying. I don't know if it will go well. I wish I was there. <laughs> oh god, the true horror begins. I wish I was there. Oh my god. This is greatness. Alright! Fine, fine! <laughs> this voice is gonna kill me. But... But did you wait for? But did you wait for me after all? I guess you don't have it. You don't have it in you to be mean, even if you want to. Oh, you don't even know. Oh, you don't even know. I can be mean, you bitch. Whatever you, whatever you say, Sayori. <laughs> Lovely laugh. Lovely girl. Lovely laughter. Yeah. Man, this little guy is cool. Sorry, quite the looker. <laughs> You're blowing it. <laughs> we cross the streets together and make our way to school. As we draw near, the streets become increasingly speckle, uh, fickle. I'm foreign, all right. With all the students making their daily commute, I'm quite sure the chat is just gonna write it and, and tell me how I pronounce that. By the way, Luigi, me, me. Have you decided on a club to join yet? Me? Uh, maybe the one in the title of the game. That's a possibility. I haven't, you know, decided quite yet, but maybe. See the childhood friends, so you got some good points. I guess. I guess. A club? How about anime club? I heard that, you know, they watch anime there. You just gotta put up with, you know, the smell for a little bit, but, eh. I told you already, I'm really not interested in joining any club. <laughs> so she's probably used to it. Alright. Fuck no, I'm the protagonist. I'm just gonna brood in the corner. Uh, really? You're just gonna brood in the corner? See, but that's not me. I don't brood in the corner. I'm just loud and obnoxious, and everybody needs to know that I'm around. I haven't been looking either. So shut up. Uh, that's not true! Why do you make those noises at the end of your sentences? I don't know! Mm. 
told me you would. <clears throat> I just spit all over my screen. You told me you would join a club this year. <laughs> Stop it. Did I? <laughs> I'm sure it's possible that I did, but this is me speaking. I said many things all the time. Like, literally, I say many things all the time. But okay. In one of our many conversations where I dismissively go along with whatever she's going on about. Wow. Yeah, pretty much I do that. It's March from The Simpsons. <laughs> <laughs> Sayori likes to worry a little too much about me. But I'm perfectly content just getting by on the average on on the average while spending my free time on games and anime. And sushi and pizza and tacos. I'm hungry, as you guys can tell. <laughs> Lovely. I was talking about how I'm worried. I was talking about how I'm worried that you won't learn how to socialize or have any skills before college. Man, your happiness is really important to me, you know. All right, listen. <clears throat> All right. Okay, I see that. Okay, I know where this is going, but listen, Sayori. How about no? And, and I know you're happy now, but I die at the thought of you becoming a neat in a few years because you're not used to the real world. <laughs> I'm gonna regret giving her this voice, innit? You trust me, right? Um, I don't know. I don't trust anything about this game. I don't even know why I'm playing this game. People told me to play it, so I'm very cautious about this. Don't make me keep worrying about you! Well, that sounds like a personal problem. Alright. I. I! Just, just, just stop talking, please. I can't take your lovely voice any longer. No, really, I, I can't. My throat. <coughs> Alright. <coughs> I'll look a few clubs. I'll, I'll look a few clubs if it makes you happy. You know? But no promises, though. Will you at least promise me you'll try a little? Meh! A little. Yes. I guess I'll promise you that. Yeah! Yeah! It's fine, you're just exaggerating it. I, I know, Mike. I, I know. I know I'm exaggerating. <laughs> God damn it, Mike. I'm gonna smack you with Shari Sayori. Why do I let myself get lectured by such a carefree girl? More than that, I'm surprised I even let myself relent, uh, relent to her. I guess seeing her worry so much about me makes me want to ease her mind at least a little bit. Even if she does exaggerate everything inside of her head. You dummy. Alright, so far so good. I don't wanna hurt myself yet. The school day is ordinary as ever. And it's over before I know it. This shit is building to something horrible, isn't it? Oh, I'm gonna hate all of you. All of you. After I pack up my things, I stare blankly at the wall, looking for an un, uh, for an ounce of motivation. Can't find any. Clubs. Tyori wants me to check out some clubs. I guess I have no choice but to start with the anime club and put up with the smell. I heard they have pizza. Probably not. I don't know. Get on, Dad. <coughs> Hello? Me? Sayori. Hi. Sayori must have come into the classroom while I was spacing out. I look around and realize that I'm the only one left in the classroom. <laughs> if you know what I mean. <laughs> wing, wing, notch, notch. <coughs> You're gonna go shower before the good stuff gets in there? Okay. That makes me think that things are gonna happen. Oh boy. I thought I'd catch you coming out of the classroom, but I saw you just sitting here and spacing out, so I came in. Meh. 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 Honestly, you're even worse than me sometimes. I'm impressed. Alright, listen here, you little shit. <laughs> you don't need to wait up for me if it's going to make you late to your own club. 
Well, I thought you might need some encouragement, so I thought, you know, mm, you know, a little wink wink notch notch. Maybe, but listen, uh, know what? Well, then you can come to my club. Oh, I see. I see. You're trying to seduce me, so I joined your club. I'm hurt. Right here, in the Kokoro. My Kokoro that goes Doki Doki, you know? I dare you. Tayori? Yeah? There is no way I'm going to I'm going to your club. Like... No. Me! Mini! I am mean. I love being mean. I don't know why. Of course you are. The only one look how I'm in the classroom. <laughs> Sayori is... Sayori is the vice president of the literal club. And I'm gonna go there because that's the name of the, the game. So there's no way around it. Not that I was ever aware that she had an interest in, you know, reading shit and stuff. You know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? Yeah, I'm not, you know what I'm saying. In fact, I'm 90% sure that she only did it because she thought it would be fun to help start a new club. So, you know, decided to make a, a, a club all about reading shit. Listen, Sayori. Listen to me, Sayori. I could, you know, be playing other spooky games. Give me some. Since she was the first one to show interest after the one who proposed the club, she inherited the title of Vice President. Okay. That said, my interest in literature is uh, guaranteed to be even less. Yeah, I'm going to the anime club. Hopefully they have pizza and, you know, the, the, the smell is a little bit bearable. Hopefully. Come on, please! Mm, please, 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 please! Come on, come on, come on, please, please! 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 Come on, please! What do you care so much, anyway? Well, you know... You know, I think I have told the club yesterday I will bring a new member! Aha! Uh -huh. You lying little conniving... And uh, Natsu can make cupcakes and everything! Oh, uh, you say cupcakes. Did you mention? <laughs> Listen, man, I'm work. Okay, then I get it. Sorry. <laughs> I'm sorry, then. All right. <laughs> <laughs> Don't make promises you can't keep. I'm not talking to you, Dan. I'm talking to her. I can't tell if Say Sayori is really that much of an airhead, or is she so cunning? As to have planned all of this out. But they do have cupcakes though. And I'm super hungry right now. I let out a long sigh. This guy's me. This is, he's just me. <laughs> let's let's give it the <clears throat> I Dan, chill. Chill. Relax. <laughs> I'm not talking about our club, alright? Alright. <clears throat> I let out a long sigh. Yada yada let's say. Fine. I'll stop by the cupcake, okay? I mean, I'll stop for the cupcake. I'll <laughs> stop by the cupcake. <laughs> yeah, let's go! Aha! Right me! Yeah, you convince me with cupcakes! You're eating a cheesecake? You know what? Fuck it, I need food. Hold on. Alright, alright, alright. Hold on, hold on. I have some stuff over here. Um, I can't. You guys were talking about tacos and things and I'm hungry I need to come on can you just get out of the piece of shit I want to eat all right all right, all right give me a second <clears throat> uh-huh all right I got it I got it I got it mm, all right and thus today mark the day I sold my soul for a cupcake I was hungry all right I actually followed Sayori across the school and upstairs, a section of the school I rarely miss it, being generally used for third year classes and activities. Fucking activities. Hmm. Alright, fine. Let me put this down. <coughs> Sayori, full of energy, swings open the classroom door and... And... And still Sayori, come on, show me somebody else. Everyone, the new member is here. Wait a minute. I didn't say I was gonna join just yet. 
I told you, don't call me a new member. Ugh. I glance around the room. Uh, girl one. That's her name. That's a pretty name. I think I'll call my first daughter that. Girl one. Welcome to the literal that literature club. It is a pleasure meeting you. Why did I give you this voice? I don't know, but now you're going to keep it. Sayori always says nice things about you. Seriously? Oh, girl too. Never mind. She looks just like Sayori. Jesus Christ. <laughs> girl one. Wow, sir. <laughs> Welcome back, Jerry. <clears throat> we need a voice for this one. <coughs> hmm. Um. God damn it. <coughs> I need a voice. Hmm. 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 Huh. Seriously, you brought a boy. Wow. Oh, why? Why would I give her that voice? Fuck it. It's hers now. You brought coffee and bagels. Hmm. Why would you? You brought a boy. Way to kill the atmosphere. Listen here, you little flat. Mm. Hey, I like this one. Girl 3. That's a lovely name. Ah, Luigi, what a nice surprise. Okay, I gotta give her a boy. Ah, mm, eh, mm. Ooh, ah, e, ah, ooh. Mm. I don't have food. I have, like, some dessert shit. I have, I have, uh, tiramisu shit. I'm just chewing on this. Not actual sustainable food. It's just junk. Uh, I need a boy. Mm. Oh, oh, ah, ooh, ah, Luigi! What a nice surprise! Ha ha ha! Yes! Actually, fuck it. I'm changing the name, uh, the voice for the middle one. I already have a voice. Welcome to the club. Uh huh. <clears throat> All words escape me in this situation. This club is full of incredible cute girls. And all of a sudden, I can't think straight. Damn you, dick. You have foiled my plans again. Okay, I have a new voice for her. <clears throat> ah, what are you looking at? Ah, oh. <laughs> what, what are you looking at? Ah, oh, oh, oh. If you want to say something, say it. Oh. Um, sorry. Natsuki. Oh, that's her name. Mm. Oh. Oh. The girl with the sour attitude, whose name is apparently Natsuki, is one I don't recognize or care for. She just looks exactly like Sayori, but a lot more pink. <laughs> that's freaking hot. <laughs> oh. Her small figure makes me think she's probably a first year student. Or she's, you know. Doesn't eat that much. She's malnourished, you know. She's also the one who made cupcakes, according to Sayori. I don't trust those cupcakes anymore. Oh, Sayori, you're still here. Uh, you can just ignore her when she gets moody. Me! <laughs> Sayori says that quietly into my ear. Oh, that was quietly. <laughs> then turns back to the other girls. Anyway, this is Natsuki. Mm, I always full of it's always full of energy. Mm, mm, mm. And this is Yuri, the smartest in the club. No, <clears throat> don't say things like that. Oh, hold on. She has like a radio voice, wasn't it? Don't say things like that. Yuri, who appears uh, comparatively more mature and timid. Seems to have a hard time keeping up with people like Sayori and Natsuki. Oh well, um, it's nice to meet you, both of you. That's a lie. Nice to meet you, Yuri. And it sounds like you already know Monica. Monica? 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 I do know a Monica from high school. Like, man. Um, is that right? What was her voice? Yeah, I just forgot. <coughs> I got eyes for Yuri. She's a cutie. Oh, okay, I see. Yeah, you didn't miss anything. So far, just introductions and funny voices. Oh, that's right. That's right. That's right. That's what's her, that's what's her voice, right? Yeah. That's right. That's right. 
<clears throat> That's right. It's great to see you again, Luigi. Monica smiles sweetly. And um, you are the first one that's gonna die, aren't you? You're dead. You're a dead person. We do, we do know each other. Well, we rarely talk, but we were in the same class last year. And I see a dead flag when I, you know, I can't recognize a dead flag when I see one. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Strike a pose, Monica! Yeah, boy! <laughs> Monica's the one for you, Mike? I see. That's your type. Monica was probably the most popular girl in class. Smart, beautiful, athletic. Basically, b basically, completely out of my league. Y you know what? With that attitude, of course it is. I would never say that. Everybody's... I'm out of everybody's league. That's what I would say. Come on, a little more confidence, dude. Man. This character already took me out of uh, the... Uh, you know, the, the experience. He's not as narcissistic as I am. She seems a little too perfect, right? Something bad is gonna happen to her. Or she's gonna do something horrible. Either or. Let's find out. So having her smile at me so genuinely feels a little... You too? Eh, too, Monica? Thanks. Come, sit down, Luigi. We made room for you at the table. Me, 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 me. You can sit next to me or Monica. Me. Me. I'll get the cupcakes. You better get those cupcakes right the fuck now. Go, go, go. Oh, hey, I made them. I'll get them. Oh. <laughs> Sorry, I got a little too excited. Mm. Then how about I make some tea as well? The girls have a few desks arranged to uh, to form a table. As Sayori mentioned, it's been well. Uh, with an, with, I can't pronounce this word. I'm so for I'm sorry, guys. So that's there is one space next to Monica and one space next to Sayori. So I'm just gonna sit there like a dingus. Jonah, Mickey Mouse, and Gaston. Yes! <laughs> yes! You got it, good sir. <laughs> Give this man a tackle. I want a tackle. I'm hungry. Damn it. <laughs> Natsuki and uh, Gaston <laughs> and Yuri walk over to the corner of the room where Natsuki grabs a wrap tray and Yuri opens the closet. Still feeling awkward, I take a seat next to Sayori. No, uh, any options there. Natsuki probably marches back to the table, tray in hand. <laughs> We're not even 10 minutes in either. <laughs> Natsuki with those facial expressions of hers seems bitchy. Mm, yeah. Okay, this is which this is this is Mickey, right? No, yes, yes, nothing. Nice. Okay, oh, are you ready? Oh. Ta-da! Oh -ho! <laughs> oh, I have way too much fun with this. I'm gonna be in pain later on, isn't it? I'm gonna be suffering. I know. I can. I can see it. I can see it. Now I can lift the foil of the tray to reveal a dozen white. Fluffy cupcakes decorated to look like little cats. Oh, that's that's cute. <laughs> the whiskers are drawn with icing, and little pieces of chocolate were used to make the ears. Oh, that's yes. Okay, mm, that's so cute. Mm, mm. <laughs> right. Mm. All right. Her voice is supposed to be a little okay. <laughs> I had no idea you were so good at baking, Natsuki. She's a little too long with the voice. I don't know what to do with that. Oh, haha! Oh, well, you know. Oh, oh. Just hurry on, take one. Oh. Sayori grabs one first, then Monica. I follow. It's delicious. Mm. Sayori uh, talks with her mouth full, like a dingus, and has already managed to get icing on her face. Why do I care? I don't know. Come on, character. Look the other way. There's other girls in the room. I turn to the cupcake around. Uh, I turn the cupcake around in my fingers, looking for the best angle to take a bite. But you know, Natsuki, Natsuki might have a baka attitude. I don't get to weep on me, Mike. Come on. <laughs> Natsuki is quiet. I can't help but notice her sneaking glances in my direction, you little perver. Is she waiting for me to take a bite? I finally bite down. 
The icing is sweet and full of flavor. I wonder if she made it herself. This is really good! No, really, it's really good. You can start you can stop staring at me, please. Thank you, Natsuki. Oh, what why are you taking me? Oh, oh, it's not like I I Oh don't start with this bullshit. Mm, no, mm -mm, no, no, come on, skip. Haven't I heard this somewhere before? Yes, yes we have. Yes. You like anime? Here's anime. Right there. That's anime right there for you. But Yuri is kawaii, so he levels it out. I guess. <laughs> Made them for like I made them for you or anything. Oh, oh, oh. We don't know each other. I know this. I I know this. Look, no, no, don't look away. Look at me. I I know this. We just met. Shut up. Um, I thought you technically did. Tayori said. Wait, what? <coughs> well, maybe it's. Oh no, that's the wrong word. Oh, may, well, maybe it's for the new student, you know. Oh. But it's not for you, you know, you dummy. <laughs> Hold on. <laughs> Becca. 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 Oh, Becca. Uh, all right. I. You got that. I'll give up on Natsuki Where's logic and dismiss the conversation. Probably a wise decision. <laughs> you got a hot dog? What do you get hot dogs for? My stomach. Shut up. Shut up. Ryan, you're grounded. Go to the corner. Yuri returns to the table, carrying a tea, a, a tea, a tea set. She carefully plays the teacup in front of each of us before setting down, sitting, uh, setting, setting down the teapot next to the cupcake tray. You keep, um, you kept, you keep a whole tea set in the. No, that's me. That's me. How them? You keep a whole tea set in the classroom? Don't worry. The teacher just gave us a permission. After all, doesn't a hot cup of tea help you enjoy a good book? Ah ha ha, ha ha ha, okay. I guess. I. alright. Um, uh, <laughs> don't let yourself get intimidated. You is just trying to impress you. I see. Um. How you doing? You don't have to try too hard, uh, man. You know what I mean? Oh, uh, <clears throat> uh, that's not. Uh, insulted, Yuri looks away. I meant that, uh, you know, um, I believe you. Stop. Stop right there, please. Well, tea and reading might not be a pastime for me, but at least I enjoy tea. I'm glad. Yuri faintly smiles to herself in relief. Monica raises an eyebrow, then smiles at me. Don't you give me that look. Listen, I'm a lonely high school student. You shut up. So, so that made you consider a literature, literature club, eh? Well, you know, I'm the only guy here. Uh, that's, 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 a, that's, a, that's a winning point right there. God, I hope someone dies soon. <laughs> Come on! <laughs> Jerry! May I have... Yeah, Jury seems like she has a little low self-esteem, right? I was afraid of this question. Something tells me I should tell Monica that I was practically dragged here by Sayori. Well, I haven't joined any club yet, and Sayori seemed really happy here, so... Also cupcakes, and I'm hungry. To be fair, if, we, if I would have lunch, I probably wouldn't be he being here, so... That's, that's, that's okay, don't be embarrassed. We'll make sure you feel right at home, okay? Uh, as president of the Literature Club, it's my duty to make the club fun and exciting for everyone. I have the feeling her voice just slightly changed throughout the whole conversation. Everybody looks so happy, right? Monica, I'm impressed. How come you decide to start your own club? You could probably be a board member for any of the major clubs. Weren't you a leader on of the debate club last year? Uh, oh, strike a pose, baby! <laughs> well, well, you know, to be honest, I, I can stand all of the politics around the major clubs. It feels like nothing but arguing about the budget and publicity and how to, how to prepare for events. 
I'd much rather take something I personally enjoy and make something special out of it. And if he encourages others to get into literature, then he fulfills that dream. Oh my god, you're too bright! God, she's like the goddamn sun! I can't stare at her, I'm getting blinded! Stop, Sayori, you can't be this good. What the fuck are you gonna do? Do you kidnap children's? And, and, and I don't know what you do. You do something bad. You're, you're a bad person. I don't trust you. Sayori, what the fuck you want? Hey, Monica really is a great leader. Yeah. Alright. Yuri also nods in agreement. Then, then I'm surprised. Uh, 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 that's my voice now. Give me a second. <coughs> then I'm surprised there, there aren't more people in the club yet. I mean, with the whole trickery that your club members uh, go around performing, uh, is, yeah. It must be hard to start a new club. Uh, you could put it that way. Not many people are very inter interested in putting out uh, all the effort to start something brand new. Especially when it's something that doesn't grab their attention, like literature. You have to work hard to convince people that you're both uh, fun and worthwhile. But it makes school events like the festival that much more important. I'm confident that we can all really grow this grow this club before we graduate. We're all people that that that. Expect a course party once in Bible. Expect a course party once in Bible Black. Got something altogether different. <laughs> right, everyone? <laughs> I don't know what you're expecting, Jerry. I really hope that it's not as bad as I'm feeling that it's gonna get, but. Sayori says, Yeah! 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 We'll do our best! Oh, you know what? Oh. Everyone enthusiastically agrees. Such different girls, all interested in the same goal. Also, there's a bunch of girls in this room, and I'm the only guy, so fucking right? Monica must have worked really hard just to find this, uh, this three. Maybe that's why they were all so delighted by the idea of a new member joining. Though I still don't really know if I can keep up with their level of enthusiasm about literature, but, uh, you know, I guess I can read comics or something. I don't know. <coughs> Yuri. So, Luigi, what kind of things do you like to read? Well, that's a, that's a good question. The Mr. Cool Guy with all the girls, right? <laughs> Considering how little I read this past few years, I don't really have a good way of answering that. My oh god, manga. I'm a fucking weeb. It's just, it's, you know, I, I like that Boku no Hero Academia. You know, you know, fuck that. I read Saint Seiya, all right? I'm old school. Let's go. Yeah, I, I read Saint Seiya. What about it, huh? I also like some JoJo's Bizarre Adventures, you know? You know what I'm talking about? You know, strike a pose? Read? No, I wouldn't mutter quietly to myself half joking. No, you say it proudly! Spinning all over her face. I spit a lot, I'm sorry. Tell them. <laughs> Bitches love watering bites. <laughs> That's what he had suddenly. Perks up. It looks like she wants to say something, but she keeps quiet. Not much of a reader, I guess. Bitch, I just said I read manga. Don't start with me. That's a perfectly good thing to read. Remember to answer all of these questions honestly, Luigi. Listen, I'm answering as Luigi. Well, that can change. Oh yeah, I guess it can change. What am I saying? Am I socializing? Holy crap! I spoke without thinking after seeing your sad smile. Oh great, I'm a fucking pushover. Anyway, what about you, Yuri? Oh, this, wow. Well, let's see. Yuri traced the rim of her uh, teacup with her fingers. <coughs> My favorites are usually novels that build deep and complex fantasy worlds. The level of creativity and craftsmanship behind them is amazing to me. And telling a good story in such a foreign uh, telling a good story in such a foreign world is equally impressive. 
Legs in action news. <laughs> Remember to answer all the. God, he's he's a normie. Oh boy. Yuri goes on clearly passionate about her reading. She seems res uh, so reserved and timid since the m moment I walk in. But it's obvious by the way her eyes lit up uh, that uh, that she finds her comfort I comfort in the world of books, not people. But you know, I, I like a lot of things. Like, you know, my part-time job in the radio station. I sing the jingles. Stories with deep psychological elements usually immerse me as well. Isn't it amazing how a writer can so deliberately take advantage of your own lack of imagination to- Oh, wow, really? You gonna talk down to yourself like that? Come on, really? All these chicks have some serious issues. Lack of imagination to completely throw you for a loop. Anyway, I've been reading a lot of horror lately. Oh, great. You don't say. Ah, I read horror book. I read a horror book once. Once, I desperately grasped something I can relate uh, to uh, the minimal level. At this rate, Yuri might as well be having a conversation with a rock. And do you know what the rock is cooking? <clears throat> All right, Monica's boys. Really, I would have. I wouldn't have to expect that, Yuri. For some as gentle as you. I guess you could say that. But if a story makes me think, or take me to another world, then I really can put it down. So real horror is often very uh, successful at changing the way you look at the world, if, you only, if only for a brief moment. Oh, oh, I hate horror. I hate that shit. Oh, I can't stand it. Fucking, fucking scares me. Oh. Why is that? I'm pretty sure I know why. Well, I just... Uh, oh, oh, it's kind of spooky, you know? Like spooky Mondays. Oh. That's eyes dart over the, to me for a split second. Uh, don't be ashamed. <laughs> oh, I heard the maker of this game is making another game this year. Oh, well then. I would rather Peter Turner or something like that. Uh, never mind. Ah, uh, uh, just ignore me. Uh, <clears throat> that's right. You usually like to write about cute things, don't you, Natsuki? Oh, uh, wait, what? Ah, uh, uh, you, you, you're a lying bitch. Ah, uh, what? Why are we tell that? Uh, what? What gives? Uh, what gives you that idea? Uh, uh. You left a piece of crap paper behind last club meeting. It looked like you were working on a poem called. Uh, oh, oh, so don't say it aloud. Oh. And give it back, damn it! Fine, fine. <laughs> oh fuck, her boys. Sayori, here we go. <laughs> your cup your, your cupcakes, your points! <laughs> Everything you do is just as cute as you are! <laughs> Sayori sa <clears throat> Sayori Sayori is up behind uh, Natsuki and put her hands on her shoulders. I'm not cute! Oh, stop that! Oh. Natsuki, do you write your own poems? Ah, uh, well, I get sometimes. Uh. Marge Simpson's getting too close, right? <laughs> uh, I think that's impressive. Why don't you share them sometime? Oh, uh, no. Really? That's it? No? No? Alright, fine, be that way. I tried to, I tried to interact with you. I tried to be part of your fucking life. All right, be that way. Nice to get her eyes. You wouldn't like them anyway. <laughs> How the hell you know? Ah, uh, not a very confident writer, are we? I understand how Natsuki feels. Sharing that level of writing takes more than just confidence. The truest form of writing is writing to oneself. I'm sorry, what? No, no. Go... I took creative writing, all right? Listen, you need to share your stories with other people. You know what? Let's move on. You must be willing to open up to your readers, exposing your vulnerabilities and showing even the deepest reaches of your heart. Uh, fuck, bitch, I didn't tell you to tell me your life story, though. Do you even have everything? Uh, do you even have a writing experience, too? Really? 
Maybe as you share some of your work, we can set an example and help Nancy to feel comfortable enough to share hers. Yes! Show us your shit! That sounded wrong. <clears throat> I feel like the vice... You feel like the vice turned in a million ways to die in the West who just wanted to see someone get shot. <laughs> I guess it's the same for Yuri, eh? Oh! I wanted to reach some everyone's born. Mm. I don't know. <laughs> All right, all right. We'll sit in silent for a moment, like the awkward, you know, teenagers that we are. Okay, I have an idea, everyone. Question mark. Natsuki and Yuri look uh, quizzically at Monica. Let's all go home and write a poem for uh, our own. Then next time we meet, we'll all share them with each other. That way, everyone is even. Oh, mm, oh. <laughs> oh. Um, hmm. Dot, dot, dot. Yeah! Let's do it! <laughs> Plus, now that we have a new member, I think it will, be, it will help us all get a little more comfortable with each other and strengthen the bond of the club. Oh, boy. <clears throat> you know what? If this was a normal dating sim, uh, by this point, I'll be like, when is the hanky panky? I'm just saying. It is a really great genre, <laughs> I guess. Google quote: Ah, somebody shoots someone. Some, some. <laughs> Monica smiles warmly at one uh, uh, at me once again. Hold on, you know, h hold the fuck on. There's still one problem. Yeah, what's that? Now that we're back to the original topic of me joining the club, I bluntly come forward with uh, what's being on my mind the entire time. I never say I will join this club. Dicks. Tayori may have convinced me to stop by, but I, I never made any decision. I still have other clubs to look at, and um... Oh, I, lo uh, 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 I lose my train of thought. Everybody, look at this! Everybody's just looking at me! Too much pressure! Ah, oh, fuck. I'm joining this fucking club, damn it. This is a literature club, not the shoot somebody in the face club. <laughs> yeah, let's hope nobody gets shot. Please. Death glares. All four girls stare back at me with dejected eyes. Oh, God. How can you say no? There's four of them. All there. In pain, sorrow, and suffering. But, but... I'm sorry, I thought that, um... Hmm. Oh. Luigi! You, you shut up. Yo... I'm defenseless against these girls. How am I supposed to make a clear-headed decision when it's like this? Right? Yeah, fuck, man! That is, if writing poems is the price I need to pay in order to spend every day with these beautiful girls. Okay, he's thinking with his dick now. Right, well, my dick has decided, and we talk it over, and I think we're gonna stay. Okay, I decided then. I'll join the literature club. And everybody jumps up. One by one, the girls' eyes lit up. Yes, I'm so happy! Mm. I mean, one... <laughs> Well, it's always that one guy you want to shoot. Oh boy. <laughs> I mean, one dude, four girls. How can you say not to these sweethearts? Why am I such a pushover, right? Oh boy, writing poems. Let's go. Roses are red. Something else is blue. I don't fucking know. Just some. Show me some something some. There you go. That's my poem. It's lit as shit. Yeah, I'm. Yeah, okay, I already read that. So uh, wraps her arms around me, jumping up and down. Let go, please. Hey. You really did scare me for a moment. Hmm. Ah, oh, she really just came for the cupcakes. I will be super pissed. Oh, I kind of did, though. Let's not tell her that. Then that makes it official. Welcome to the Literature Club. Uh, thanks, I guess. Okay, everyone. I think with that, 
we can officially end today's meeting on a good note. Everyone remember tonight's assignment. Okay, my club is giving me homework too? I wouldn't have joined this, man. Roses, roses are red, my balls are blue. Fuck you. <laughs> okay. Can you be more specific then? We said a lot of offensive shit. <laughs> Uh, all the viewers on YouTube can't read the chat right now, and I feel sad for you guys, so... Go down to the description and click on that link to the Twitch channel and follow me, so you can join this silly silly chat. Anyway, write a poem to bring to the next meeting so we can all share. Monica looks over at me for uh, once more. Luigi, I look forward to seeing how you express yourself. Ah, oh, god damn it. Listen, I have a sailor's mouth. I don't think you wanna... I, uh, you know what? Fine. Ah, oh, I can't do the laugh. <laughs> Fair enough, I step down, says Dan. <laughs> Daniel, you sent me a picture of what? Oh, god damn it, really? Can we stop making Luigi hungry while he streams? Reading chat was my job. Yeah, I, I paid you some, what, two pesos? Yeah, and I really impressed the class after <laughs> the class star Monica with my mediocre writing skills. Wait, 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 wait! Nah, 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 nah! Ah, my writing skills. You know what? Mm, no, fuck you, game. I already feel the anxiety welling up inside me. Either that or that just a boner. I have, I, I think it's a boner. I'm up to, I'm a teenager after all, so. Meanwhile, the girls continue to chit-chat as Yuri and Natsuki clean up their, f their, their food. Hey, Luigi! Mm, since we're already here, do you want to walk home together? <laughs> That's right. Sayori and I never walk home together anymore because she always stays after school for club. Sure, might as well. Luigi, give him that cheer bit Ryan gave you earlier. <laughs> when he comes back, alright? When he comes back uh, to the house, I'll, I'll give him the penny. <laughs> yeah! Yeah! Alright. Alright, question. Is the music loud enough or it's too loud? What the shit? With that, the two of us depart the club room and make our way home. Can I press click the spacebar to move this along? The whole way, my mind wanders back to the uh, back and forward between the four girls. Yeah, I can just press spacebar. Good. Uh, roses are red, candy is sweet. I'm fucking hungry. Please stop this. <laughs> Sayori, Natsuki, Yuri, and of course Monica. Oh, sweet, sweet Monica. Will I really be happy spending every day after school in a literature club? My dick says yes. Perhaps I'll have the I'll have the chance to grow closer to one of these girls. Says my dick. All right. <laughs> the music's fine. He put the pig for the goddamn feet. What? <laughs> All right. I'll just need to make the most of my circumstances. I'm sure good fortune will find me. And I guess that's. And I guess that starts with writing a poem tonight. Also, I'm gonna take a bite of this. Give me a second. Oh. Do I have to write this shit? Mmm, 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 mmm. It is writing. It's time to write a poem. Pick words you think you are fa your favorite club members will like. Something good might happen with whoever likes your poem the most. I see. What? <laughs> what? <laughs> what? <laughs> what? <laughs> Hold on, I'm choking, I need water. <clears throat> Alright, let's... Uh, Alright, let's read this whole column. Fluffy, candy, uncanny, aura, Suicide! 
That escalated so fucking fast! <laughs> What? It's a fine, it's fine words to say here. Oh yeah, I'm gonna go with climax. All right, all right, all right, all right. <laughs> you like? No, oh, come on, dude. <laughs> Why would you say that sentence? I like suicide. <laughs> Um... That climate, you know what? You're right. <coughs> oh! Alright. Fickle. Agonizing. Bouncy. Memories. Playground. Ocean. Melody. Ah, oh, goddammit, I got that bitch. Marshmallows, music, embrace, warm, precious, existence, encouragement, disoriented, after he whisper. You know what? Let's see what happens. Oh boy, I knew it. Love, rose, comfort, play, ribbon, heartbeat, fun, bliss, boop, dazzle. Damn it! <laughs> Question Analysis Color Pause Yep Boy Let's go Oh I see She's a freak <laughs> Oh pick your favorite word Incongruent Okay <laughs> Even sense Whistler incapable Loud Pressure Fallible Unending Sunset Flying Yeah, let's go! Yeah! Yeah, we're getting there! <laughs> we're getting there. Yeah, go fuck yourself. <laughs> okay. Skipping together, flowers, scars. Oh boy, is it? Oh, you? What? <laughs> okay. Spice, bed, whirlwind, vanilla, wonderful, sparkles, ambient, thing, fantasy, sad fantasy, motherfucker. All right, all right, we can, we can. What the fuck? <laughs> Melancholic. Let's go. I knew, it. I knew I'll get you with that one. I, I knew it. Chick, secretive, nature, strawberry, clumsy, please. You know. I feel this one is for this bitch. There we go. Yeah. Massacre. Wait, there was massacre? I didn't see. <coughs> oh boy. All right. Essence, unrestrained. Fireflies. Peace. Milk. Yearning. Sadness. Philosophy. There we go. We're getting there. We're getting there. All right, landscape, tragedy, nightgown, chocolate, waterfall, universe, orange, uh, intellectual family, tragedy. Damn it! What's with your tragedy fucking boner you have? Destiny, grief, oh, extraordinary, empty. Yeah. Mm, headphones, cheer, hopeless, empty. Wow, you're a sad person. Neville, imagine imagination. She wants your dick. <laughs> imagination. Cage. There we go. There we go. Listen. I have three options. There's no competition. Yes, I'm going for Yuri. Why? Because fuck you, little bitch. Just no. Stop talking. All right, sunny, jump, beauty, vivacious, prayer, mouse, doki doki. Oh yeah, yeah, you you know it, Mike. Doki doki. Roll credits. 
God damn it. Fuck you, Mike. <laughs> Okie dokie. Zero is vape, right? Blanket, atone, laugh, tenacious, forgive, time, crimson, captive, games, determination. This is not a. Uh, uh, this is not a uh, Undertale. There we go, Crimson. Oh, she's into murder. Oh boy, she likes murder. Why do. Oh boy. I always do this to myself. <laughs> Entropy! There you go. I think I know where this bitch is going with. Oh boy. <laughs> oh, spinning, fear, rainbow, pleasure. Let's go. She has real. She likes really powerful emotions. Really powerful emotions. I miss anime? I I'm too busy for anime right now, okay? I'm trying to, uh, you know, please this bitch over here. Sucks kawaii. Fucking weird. This is gonna be you, isn't it? Graveyard. Adventure. Vertical. Peaceful. Desire. Extreme. Des desire. Let's go. You don't know. Yuri seems sweet. She might be into the whole murder mystery genre. You know what? You're right. I'm going with that. That's gonna be my take on the whole poem thing. Hi again, Luigi. Uh... Glad to see you didn't run away on us. <laughs> uh, sure. Nah, don't worry. This might be a little strange for me, but I'll at least uh, keep my word. Oh, that's true. Well, I'm back at the literature club. My dick brought me here. I just couldn't stop. I was, I was the last to come in, so everyone else is already having hanging out. Thanks for keeping your promise, Luigi. I hope this is. I hope this isn't too overwhelming of a commitment for you. Making you dive headfirst into literature when you're not accustomed to it. Oh! Oh, come on! Like he deserves any slack! Oh! So you already told me you didn't even want to join any club this year! Oh! Da did she? Hmm. And last year, too! Oh! I don't know if you plan to just come here and hang out or what! Oh! Listen! What's your problem? All right, what? What you you want to go? <laughs> but but if you don't take us seriously, then you won't see them. You won't see the end of it. Oh. That's it. You. you certainly have big mouth for someone who keeps her manga collection in the club room. <laughs> oh fuck. She's another one. She's another one of my kind, isn't it? She's another weeb. Well, you wanted to eat pizza and watch anime like he does in co at college. Yes! That's all I wanted to. Watch anime, eat pizza, just like I do in college. That's all. Join the anime club, go to John's. That's all. Mm -hmm. oh! Natsuki finds herself stuck between saying Monica and manga. <laughs> Manga's literature! Oh! Swiftly defeated, Natsuki pops uh, back into her seat. Don't worry, guys! Mm. We always give it his best as long as he's having fun! Mm. He helps me with busy work without me even asking, man! Because you're useless! Like cooking, cleaning my room, you know, helping me with my life decisions, stuff. <clears throat> How dependable! Sayori, that's because your room is so messy, it's distracting. And you almost set your house on fire once. And you live next door. So if you if your house goes, mine goes too. Is that so? You two are really good friends, aren't you? Don't don't blush. This don't she means nothing. I might be a little jealous. How come you and Luigi can become good friends too? Mm. Um, um, Sayori? Mm -hmm. uh, yeah, yeah, a little bit. I, as usual, Sayori seems oblivious to the weird situation she just put me into. Oh, 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 Yuri even brought you some something today, you know? 
Did she? Wait, Shiori. You little shit. Um, um, me? Uh, <clears throat> me? Um, not really. Don't be shy, man! It's really nothing. What is it? Um, um, never mind. Uh, Sayori made it sound like a big deal, uh, when it's really not. Um, what do I do? Um, um, I'm sorry, Yuri. I wasn't thinking. You never think. I'm talking like I know her for since forever. Well, it is time for me to move my computer to my bed. Alright, Ryan. Enjoy. I guess this means it's up to me to rescue the situation. We can salvage this. I'm an expert at salvaging disasters. You guys see me play. That's like what I do most of the time. Fuck up. And then I have to salvage it. So it's like I'm good at it because I, I have to. Hey, don't worry about it. First of all, I wasn't expecting anything in the first place. So any nice gesture from you is a pleasant surprise. I'll, it'll make me happy no matter what. Is that so? Yeah, I, I, I won't make it. A, I won't make it a big deal if you don't want it to be. Alrighty then. Well, here. Yuri reaches into her bag and pulls out a book. Oh, great, a book. I didn't want. Uh, <clears throat> I didn't want you to feel left out, so I pick up a book that I thought you might enjoy. It's a short read, so it should keep your attention. Whoa, whoa, whoa. What's that supposed to mean? Even if you don't usually read. Ah, we could, and we could, you know, <clears throat> discuss it if you want. You know, if you want. This is, um, got your book for dumb dumbs. <laughs> Shut up, Yuri. How is this girl accidentally being so cute? Oh boy, is this is happening, guys. She even picked out a book she thinks I'll like, despite me not reading much. So I'm just gonna grab it and pretend I read it. Yuri, thank you. I'll definitely read this. Um, says my dick. Damn it, dick! Why you come? Ah, fine, I'll read it. I enthusiastically take the book. Phew. Well, you can read it at your own pace. I look forward to hearing what you think. Now that everyone's settled in. I expected Monica to kick off some schedule activities for the club. But that doesn't seem to be the case. Tayori and Monica are having a, a cheery conversation in the corner. Yuri's face is already buried in a book. Uh, I can't help but notice her intense expression like she was waiting for this chance. Meanwhile, Natsuki is uh, uh, rummaging around in the closet. Why? Oh, the manga, yeah. She got me Harry Potter. We got me Harry Potter! Uh, oh, oh my god! Oh shit! Thanks for the follow! Longus? Is, is that how I pronounce it? Well, thank you for the follow, dude. I appreciate it. I'm really curious to talk to Yuri a little bit more. Yeah, yeah, we are. I mean, we try really hard. But at the same time, I will feel bad for uh, distracting her from reading. I catch a glimpse of the cover of her book. It looks like the same book that she lent to me. More than that, she seems to be on a, on the first few pages. So that means she wants to read it so she can talk to me. She's she's reading Harry Potter for me. How sweet. I hope she li she likes the slittering, eh? I'm gonna slitter in, you know what I mean? Like, oh, okay. <clears throat> ah. Crap. I think she noticed me looking at her. That's good, dude. Just go talk to her. Said so like, yo, can you can you help? You know, this book. What make you think that I would like it? You know, out of curiosity, you strike a conversation. You are in the same club, all right? And she clearly is into you. She so just go and talk to. Her. God damn, I'm just gonna choke this character. Dirty Barry. <laughs> she sneaks another glance at me, and her eyes meet for a split second. There you go. It's on! Dude, it's on like Donkey Kong! Let's, let's go! <laughs> but that only makes her hide her face deeper in her book. Oh, great, fantastic. You missed your chance. Just go in! Just go balls deep, man! 
It's like, help, I can't read. Yeah, that's a good excuse, right? How you pronounce this word? That is pronounced I. Oh, thank you. I'm not good with reading stuff. Uh, sorry. I was just spacing out. Uh, it's not like I was checking you out or anything. I muttered this, uh, sensing I uh, uh, made her uncomfortable. Oh. It is fine. If I was focused, then I probably wouldn't have noticed in the first place. But I'm just rereading a bit of this. So. And that's the book you gave me, right? Hmm. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. I wanted to reread it, uh, reread some of it. Not for any particular reason. Uh, just curious how. Uh, <coughs> that's her voice. Uh, no, that's my voice. Just curious. How come you have two copies of the same book? Clearly, one for collection and the other one for reading. And she gave you the one for reading. <laughs> she don't let everybody know. <laughs> Remind me of fifty first days. Uh, don't worry, Dan. I mean, Fuji. I, I mean, Fuji. It was an Anno Club reference. <clears throat> All right. Ah, well, when I stopped at the bookstore yesterday, uh, that's not what I, what I meant. Uh, I mean, uh, I just happened to buy two of them. How? How does somebody just happens to buy? No, no, you're bullshitting me. You want this, and you know it. Just tell me. Just fucking tell me. Why is the point of beating around the bush? I see. There's something fairly obvious here that Yuri isn't telling me, but I decide to let it go. Because you know what, you might as well. I'll definitely start reading it reading soon. I'm glad to hear that. Once it starts to pick up, you might have a hard time putting it down. Uh, you know what I mean. Wink, wink, notch, notch. Um, it's a very engaging and relatable story. Is that so? What is it about, anyway? Well, hmm. Yuri closes the book and scans her eyes uh, over the bag. The book is titled Portrait of Markov. There's an ominous-looking eye symbol on the front cover. Oh, great. Uh, all right. Really, this is gonna bring Poro back. Oh, no! Poro, no! <laughs> Poro, no! <laughs> Why would you do this, Dan? Why would you do this? I just wanted to make sure I don't accidentally give anything away. Basically, it's about this girl in high school who moves in with her long-lost younger sister. But as soon as she does, does so, her life gets really strange. She gets targeted by these people who escape from a human experiment prison. And while her life is in danger, she needs to desperately choose who to trust. No matter what, uh, are you telling me your backstory? I hope not. I hope this doesn't turn into that shit. That's too anime for me. Uh, we can't. <coughs> Oh, you don't know who Poro is? You see that emote that, that Dan just posted? Alright, if you scroll down right now on the Twitch channel, you're gonna see a big picture of, uh, of a dog with angel wings. If you click on it, it will send you to a YouTube video. And that would explain who is Poro and why I decided to make him an emote for my channel. Because he's my homie and I will forever miss him. So you just, just 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 scroll down and come back to me as soon as you're done with the video. <clears throat> okay, no matter what she does, she ends up destroying most of her relationships and her life starts to fall apart. That's kind of um sad. That's kind of dark, isn't it? Yeah. Yuri made it sound like it was going to be a nice story, so that dark turn came from nowhere. I think she's so in my face that I like Madoka Magica. Oh, you shall dig deeper into the lore of Poro. Got it. <laughs> <laughs> Yuri, Yuri gently uh, giggles. That was a giggle, yes. All of a sudden. Are you not a fan of that sort of thing, Luigi? No, it's not that. I mean, I, I watch stuff. I watch Madoka Magica, don't get me wrong. 
I mean, I can definitely enjoy those kind of stories, so don't worry. I hope so. Yeah, I, I totally forgot that you were into those things. That dark stuff. She's so shy and reclusive on the outside, but her mind seems to be completely different. A little scary if you ask me. It's just that those kinds of stories, they challenge you to look at life from a strange new perspective. When horrible things happen, not just because someone wants to be evil, but because they have their own goals or their own philosophy and they believe uh, that they believe in. Then suddenly, when you thought you you related to the protagonist, uh, they're... Oh boy, you're gonna tell me you're gonna relate to the, the to the bad guy? All right, they made out of the made out to be an, uh, the naive one for letting their one-sided morals interfere with the villain's plan. Oh boy, oh boy, it's happening now, guys. I'm uh, I'm rumbling, aren't I? Not again. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Hey, don't apologize. I have lost. Of, I, I haven't lost interest or anything. I mean, I'm here listening to you. Stop it. Stop being like this. I'm clearly fucking listening. Well, uh, I guess it's all right then. But I feel like I should let you know that I have this problem. Oh boy, here we go. When I let things like books and writing fill my thoughts, I cannot forget to pay attention to other people. So I'm sorry if I end up saying something strange. And please, stop me if I start talking too much. That's okay, that's, that's fine. I really don't think you need to worry. Just, 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 just go off. Just, just, just go for it. I don't mind. Just go. <clears throat> that just means you're passionate about reading. The least I can do is listen, right? It's a literature club, after all. Ah, that's, um, well, that's true. In fact, I might as well get started reading it, right? You, you, you don't have to. Haha, <laughs> what are you saying? You gave me the goddamn book, I might as well read it. Just a moment ago, you said you were looking forward to it. Don't give me the dot 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 dot. Let me just get the book. I quickly retrieved the book that I had put into my bag. Alright, it's fine. Uh, if I sit here, right? Slip into the seat next to yours. Oh boy, we're in, guys. We're in. Ah, uh, yeah. Are you sure? I mean, that, that's what I say, are you sure? You seem a little apprehensive. That's, um, I'm sorry. It's not that I don't want you to. It's just that something I'm not very used to. That is, reading in company with someone. I see. Well, just tell me if I end up distracting you or anything. Alrighty then. I opened the book and start uh, the prologue. Holy shit! Whew. Thanks, Ryan. <laughs> Thanks for the subscribe, dude. <laughs> You're paying the bills. <laughs> Ah, uh, see what happened to Poro. You never seen what happened to Poro? Go down there and check it out. And don't laugh, Jerry. Damn it. I opened the book and started the prologue. <clears throat> you subscribed for the Poro emote, didn't you? <laughs> and the auras. That was a lot more money, though. <laughs> it was the worst. That it was worse than I thought, right? <laughs> I soon understand what Yuri means about reading in company. It's happens I can I can feel her presence over my shoulder as I read. It's not a particularly bad thing. I mean, it smells kind of nice. I don't know. I'm, I'm not a creep. Maybe a little distracting, but the feeling is somewhat comforting. Yuri is in the corner of my eye. I realize that she's not actually looking at her own book. I glance over. It looks like she's reading from my book instead. Ah, we're in. <coughs> You subscribe for Dio Sama? Well, thanks for the subscribe, though. So, so, so sorry. I was just Yuri. You, you really apologize a lot, don't you? Uh, I do. I don't really mean to. Sorry. Ah, oh my God, she did it again. I mean, ha 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 ha. Ah, stop that, please. Here, this is this, this should work, right? I slide my desk until it's up against Yuri's. Then hold my book more... Uh, why am I reading like her? 
my book more uh, between the two of them. Ah, I suppose so. You're intimately close to her uh, own copy. Once we each lean in a little, in a little bit, our shoulders are almost touching. Almost touching, though. Almost touching. Muda, muda, muda. Indeed. It feels like my left arm is in the way, so instead of uh, instead I use my right hand to hold the book up. Ah, I guess that makes it kind of difficult to turn the page. Here. Oh boy, we got a we got a special cutscene, guys. Let's go. We got them pictures. That's, we're on our way to Hanky Panky. Let's go. <laughs> she's gonna die, isn't it? No, she's gonna kill me. I, yeah, she's gonna kill me. Yeah. Oh, no, no. Uh, Judy takes her left arm and holds uh, the left side of the book between her thumbs and, and forefingers. Ah. I do the same with my right arm on the right side of the book. That way I turn a page and Judy slices it, uh, slice it under her thumb after I flip uh, to her side. Yeah. But in holding it like this, we're huddled even closer together than before. She's liking it though. She's fucking liking it though. You're one step away from sharing gum with her. Oh shit! It's actually kind of distracting me. <laughs> it's as if I can feel the warmth of Yuri's face and she's in the corner of my vision. Uh, are you ready? Oh, she's looking at me. That's kinda. okay. Huh? <clears throat> um? To turn the page, dingus. Oh, yes, yeah, sorry. Sure. I think I got a bit distracted for a second. I glance over Yuri's face again and our eyes meet. I don't know how I'll be able to keep up with her. Ah. Uh, that's okay. Oh, she's smiling. Oh, we're in. You see that smile? We're balls deep in. Let's go. You could say. You're not as used to reading, right? I don't mind being patient if it takes you a bit longer. It is probably the least I can do. Thanks for being so patient with me. Yeah. Thanks. We we'll continue reading. Very awkwardly. <laughs> you no longer ask me if I'm reading to turn the page. Instead, I just assume that she's finished. She finished the page before me. So I turn a bit my uh, I turn it by my own volition. We continue the first chapter in silence. Even so, turning each page almost feels like an intimate exchange. Oh, come on. My thumb gently letting go of the page, letting it flutter over to her side as she catches it under her own thumb. Why are you make? Okay, this sounds a little, uh... <laughs> it takes notes. <laughs> That's just wrong, Mike. <laughs> That's just wrong. I agree with Dan. Half a ball deep in. Damn. Hey, Yuri. Uh, this might be a silly thought, but uh, the main character kind of reminds me of uh, you a little bit. Oh boy. You think so? <clears throat> How does she? Well, I guess she's more blunt in a lot, uh, blunt in a lot of uh, ways, but she also second guesses all of the things that she says and does. Like she's afraid she'll do something wrong. What are you saying? You stop right there. You're, you're no. This is this is not like. This is not first time conversation with a chick, dude. No, come on. All right, okay. He's fucking up. He's fu guys, guys, he's, fu he's fucking up. He's fucking up. He's too honest. Mm -mm, mm -mm. It's not like I can see into your head or anything. But they're kind of remo uh, of rem they're kind of reminis reminiscent of uh, someone of your uh, mannerism. Uh, I see. He's fucking up. He's fucking up. He fucked up. He fucked up, guys. Pull, pull him out. Pull him out. <laughs> Bail out, dude. Bail out. <laughs> Be gentle, dude. She seems fragile. I'm sorry. He's in the morning to perverse a little bit. <laughs> Wrong. Go balls deep every day, all day. Yep. You remain silent for a moment. But Luigi, that's probably a terrible thing to have in common with her. Right? Why would you say that? Why would you say that, you dingus? Tell me. No such thing as pull out game. You're right. We're, we're in already, but. <laughs> oh, man, this guy's stupid. Um, that's so embarrassing that, uh, that you think that. Um, wait, oh, shit, you see what you did, you dumbass? 
I didn't mean in a bad way or anything. Uh, sorry, I, I really didn't know you were self-conscious about that sort of thing. Why wouldn't she? You? Oh my god, I want to choke this guy right now. Well, we officially fucked up. We fucked this one up royally. I guess I more uh, I meant that it's kind of cute. Oh, okay, we're salvaging. We're salvaging this. We're salvaging. She's shy. The cute thing is gonna get her. Oh. Uh, what are you saying all of a sudden? Yeah, 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 yeah. We got it back. We got it back. We got it back, guys. We got it back. <laughs> we got it back. <laughs> okay, everyone. Oh, this cock blocking bitch. Okay, everyone. Eee! I think it's about time we share today's poem with each other. We might not have enough time if we wait too long. Oh. Yuri exhales, spares from uh, finishing her thoughts. Is that alright, Yuri? Uh, you look kind of down. I'm sorry, uh, I'm sorry if you ha haven't been looking forward to this. Oh, it's, n it's not. Um, it's fine. Yuri releases her hand from the book, causing it to close up on top of Mike's bomb. You dumbass. Alrighty then. I guess I'll do some more reading tonight. Oh, would you prefer if I only read it with you? Um, I guess I don't have too much of a preference either way. Man, he fucked up. He fucked up. He fucked up. No, no, no. I, no, I mean him. When things are going right, I put myself into the character shoot. When he fucks up, it takes me out of the experience. Dad, like, why would you say that? Why would you say that? Fuck, I, I didn't even have an option to say something else. <coughs> hmm. In that case, I'll read a little more tonight. It'll be more fun to read with you after I pick up a bit, you know? That, that is good reasoning. In that case, feel free to finish the first two chapters in your own time. Alrighty then. I stand up. I make a mental note of where I left off in the book, and then slip it back to, into my bag. By the way, you remember to write a poem last night? Yeah, it's pretty fucking dark. It's, it's really gnarly. I can't wait to show you. Yeah. My re relaxation ends. I can't believe I agreed to do something so embarrassing. But here we are. No going back. Just jump in there and just, just, just do it. I couldn't really find much inspiration since I never really done this before. Well, now that everyone's ready, why don't you find someone to share it with? Oh, I know who's gonna like this shit. No, get the fuck out of here! <laughs> Sayori, get the fuck out of here! Man, I can't wait! Man! Sayori and Monica enthusiastically pull out their poems. Sayori is on, is on, a, uh, on a wrinkly sheet of loose leaf, thorn from a spiral notebook. Your point is about death, blue balls, and suicide. Extreme. It's fucking gnarly, dude. <laughs> On the other hand, Monica wrote hers in a composition notebook. How far? I can already see Monica's uh, pristine ha handwriting from where I see. Natsuki and Yuri relentlessly comply as well, reaching into their bags. I do the same myself. Alright, let's see how this was gonna go. Who shall I show my poem to first? Ah, ah, ah. We can salvage this. We can totally salvage. Man, but Monica though. Fuck. I almost feel bad for Sayori. She's a childhood friend, yet you have feelings for Yuri. I have feelings for no one. Don't you put those words in my mouth. <laughs> Monica writes need. <laughs> alright, alright. Yeah, any mini mini more. Oh my god. Okay, listen, I already have a connection with her, okay? Okay, okay. We're in. I think. We kinda fucked it up a little bit though. But Monica though. Harris inserts herself in the game, just to, just to reverse it. Alright, why are we bringing my girlfriend into this? Paris, you're watching. This is just a game, okay? Jesus Christ, Ryan. <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> Alright. Dude, make a decision. Shut up! Shut up! Shut up! I'm trying! Ah, fuck, 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 fuck! Ah, fuck it! 
I should start with Monica. Yesterday she seems eager to read my poem, and I want to hear uh, her to know I'm putting in effort. It's 3 a.m. Fine. <laughs> Hi, Luigi. Having a good time so far? Uh, sh yeah. Good. Glad to hear it. By the way, since you're new and everything, if you ever have uh, any suggestions for the club, like new activities or things we can do better, I'm always listening. Don't be afraid to bring things up, okay? Oh, don't worry. I'm very loud and obnoxious when I don't like shit. Alright, I'll keep that in mind. Of course, I'll be afraid to bring things up. No, dude, come on. I'm such a, uh, I'm much better of just going on with the flow until I'm uh, more settled in. Anyway, want to share your poem with me? It's kind of embarrassing, but I guess I have to. <laughs> Don't worry, Luigi. Okay, you say you have feelings for no one. No, Ryan. What I mean, feelings for no one, I meant in the game. Jesus Christ, dude. <laughs> My God, this chat. The year just started, you guys. Come on, it's like a post, Monica. I hate you guys. I hate you. I already hated you, and it's not because of the game. <laughs> We're a little embarrassed today, you know. But it's that sort of very that we'll we'll all learn to get past. It. Yeah, that's true. I had Monica in my poem. Hmm. Oh, uh, you're not gonna like it. It's about dead murder and destruction. It's very gnarly, though. Great job, Luigi. Ah, she didn't like it. He, he didn't like it. Either. What's going oh in my head while reading? It? It's really me metaphorical. What's that supposed to mean, bitch? I'm not sure why, but I didn't expect you to go for something so deep. I guess I understand you. It is easy for, uh, <clears throat> it is easy for me to keep everyone's expectations low. <laughs> Boy, that way is always counts when I put in some effort. Right? Right? Everybody's pleasantly surprised. Monica makes the best poses. You're right. <laughs> That's not very fair. Well, I guess it works anyway. You know th that Yuri likes this kind of writing, right? Yeah, I know. Ah, fucking know. Writing that's full of Im imagery and symbolism. Unlike Sayori, who likes using simple and direct words to describe happiness and sadness. Yuri likes it when readers are left to the, uh, derive their own meaning out of, out of it. It's very challenging to write like that effectively. Both allowing people to get something out of it just by feel or letting them deeply analyze uh, all of their all of their news. Oh boy. Moo Club Grump? <laughs> it can take years of practice, which I'm assuming Yuri has at this point. I never really asked though. I'm, sh uh, I'm sure I'm nowhere near her level. Don't worry so much about that. You do your own thing. Just keep exploring and learn by trying new things. I'm sure I'll end up trying different things. I'll, I'm sure I'll end up trying different things a lot. I could take a while before I feel comfortable doing this, though. That's okay. I love to see you try new things. That's the best way to find a, the kind of style that suits you. Everyone else might be a little bit biased towards their own kind of styles, but I'll always help you find what suits you the most. Yo, she's so cool, though. Why is she so cool, though? Remember, when he fucks up, it's the character's fault. Yeah, you're right. <laughs> One of my suspicions in mode. <laughs> Boom. So don't force yourself to write the way everyone else wants you to write. Listen, I'm trying to get something sound over here. I don't know. Not like you have to worry about impressing them or anything. Ha ha ha. Ha 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 ha. Alright. Anyway, you want to read my poem now? Uh, don't worry. I'm not very good. You see, I hate when people start with that, but okay. You sound pretty confident for someone who claims to not be very good. Well, that's because I have to sound confident. Oh, shit. That's not, that's, that doesn't mean I'm, I always feel that way, you know? I see. This guy says I see way too much. I, I relate. I said I see way too much, too. Well, let's just read it then. Uh, the glory hole in the wall. It couldn't have been me. See? The direction this fake hole protrudes. Oh boy. A, noise, a noisy neighbor. 
an angry boyfriend. I'll never know. I wasn't home. I peered inside for a clue. No! I said. I said no. I can't see. A real... A real... Real? Blind? Like a film left out in the sun. But it's too late. My retina... My retinas... What? Okay, I'm reading. I don't know what I'm doing. I'm murdering English, alright? That's what I'm doing. Why this booty in the chat? Nick! Why do you... Why is there so much booty in the chat, Nick? <laughs> I just turn around to see the chat, and all of a sudden I see booty. And now there's a knife. You're the Hitler of reading. Yes! <laughs> this is genocide. <laughs> but it's too late. My retinas. Already scorched with a permanent copy of the meaningless image. It's just a little hole. It wasn't too bright. It was too deep. What the fuck? I hate poems like this. I don't know what you mean, bitch. Oh, boy. Stretching forever into everything. A hole of infinite choice. I realize now that I wasn't looking in. I was looking out. Okay. Wow. All right. And he, on the other side, was looking in. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. I think we're in, too, boys. I think we're in. <laughs> and now there's... There's chopped up heads in the ch chat now. What the fuck? <laughs> All right, click outside the point. Hey, to continue. Uh, so what did you think? Um, it's very freeform. Yeah, that's the word I'm gonna use. If that's what you call it. Uh, sorry, I'm not really the right person to ask for f uh, feedback. Ah, it's okay. Yeah, that that kind of style has gotten pretty popular nowadays. That is, a lot of poems have been putting emphasis on the uh, timing between words and lines. When performed out loud, it can be really powerful. Yeah, I fucked it up though. I, I just murdered the fucking poem. I, I just took it to the to the back door and shot him in the face. I, it's just dead. I killed this fucking poem. The warning in the game wasn't for the game. It was for Luigi's reading. Yeah, boy. <laughs> uh, what was the inspiration behind this one? Ah. Well, I'm not sure if I know how to put it. I guess you could say that I had some kind of epiphany recently. It's been influencing my poems a bit. An epiphany, you say? Yeah, something like that. I, I'm kind of nervous to talk about deep stuff like that. Because it's kind of uh, coming up strongly. Maybe after everyone's very better friends with each other. Anyway, here's Monica's, uh, here's Monica's writing tip of the day. Sometimes when you're writing a poem or a story, your brain gets too fixated on a specific point. If you try so hard to make it perfect, then you'll never make any progress. Just force yourself to get something down on paper and tidy up for later. Actually, this applies for uh, art as well. Um, if you're making a drawing and you know you, you're, you're slacking off, and, like you just can't get through because you, you're not getting this thing right, just fucking draw, dude. Just, just put something down on the paper and draw. Just produce something. And make it your schedule. Just keep working on it. That's your Luigi's artist tip of the day. Warren. <laughs> okay. Another way to think about it is this. If you keep your pen in the same spot for too long, you'll just get a big dark puddle of ink. So just move your hand and cover with the flow. That's my advice for today. Thanks for listening. Like, comment, and subscribe. We all know what we're gonna do next, right? Let's go. Go, Yuri! Can I skip the other bitches, though? As a person that writes, I know the feel. Yeah. Oh, what's up? What's up, baby girl? As Yuri reached the point, I noticed her eyes... Li oh, oh, she's liking it! Exceptional. Uh, hold on, I forgot her voice. <coughs> Exceptional. Uh, what was that? <laughs> uh, did I say that out loud? Yuri first covers her mouth, but then ends up covering her whole face. Um... He's going to hate me. Um, I heard that. I can read minds. Holy shit. I'm a psychic. You really didn't do anything wrong, Yuri. Huh? That's, um... Uh, I guess you're right. 
What am I getting so nervous for? Ha 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 ha. Yuri takes a, a breath. So, what kind of writing experience do you have? Absolutely jack shit. I'm good at that. I'm a psycho, which is which is close. <laughs> All right then. <laughs> your use uh, your use of Im imagery and metaphors indicates you've written a lot of poetry before. Actually, I'm just fucked up in the head. Really? Yeah, yeah, no, no. I'm just fucked up in the head. Oh, there's a huge compliment coming from you. Uh, this is actually my first time, really. Huh? You always stares at me blankly. Then looks at my poem again. Please don't get jealous and stab me. Oh no. Well, I know that. Um, I just meant um, um. Yuri trails off, unable to find an excuse. She twists her finger along the word, uh, the words in the poem, as if breaking it down more throughout. Me. Yeah. Okay. This is the reason I was able to tell. It's just that there is a specific writing habits that are usually typical of new writers. And having been through that myself, I kind of uh, learned to pick up, uh, pick up on them. I think the most noticeable thing I recognize in new writers is that they try to make their style very deliberate. In other words, they tend to pick writing styles separate from their topic matter, and they form fit they, the two together. Then the, the end result is that both the style and the expressiveness are weakened. Once you find her train of thought, it is as her uh, demeanor totally changes. Her stammering is completely gone, and she sounds like she's an expert, and she keeps blabbering about stuff, and reading, and books, and uh, here we go. Of course, that's not something you can be blamed for. There's so many different skills and techniques that uh, go into writing, even a simple poem. Not just finding, oh my gosh, she's going on about this, god damn it. We're in though, we're in, but she won't shut up. <clears throat> Not just finding them, uh, building them, uh, but getting them to work together is probably the most challenging part. It might take you some time, but it'll, come, uh, but it'll come with a practice and learning by example and trying new things. I also hope that everyone else in the club, uh, uh, yeah, this is her, club gives you a valuable feedback. Natsuki can be a little bit biased though. Yeah, biased, how? Um, well, never mind. I shouldn't be talking about people like that. Sorry. It, 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 it's fine, it's fine, it's fine, it's fucking fine. I'm not sure if Yuri apologizes to herself, to me, or Natsuki. But let's move on with our life, shall we? You mind if I read your poem now? Oh boy, I can't wait. Let's go. Alright, guys. Please do. I love to share my thoughts and process behind it. Yuri smiles dreamily as, as that a rare opportunity for her, which itself is kind of funny. After all, isn't this supposed to be a literature club? Oh boy. Alright. <clears throat> Goes under the light. I can read that. The, the, ten, the tendrils there you go, of my hair illuminate beneath the amber glow. Baiting. It must be this one. The last remaining streetlight to have withstood the test of time. I know that it's trying to make it like it's handwriting, but it's making it hard for me to read. I just gotta get really close to my screen and actually see what is written there. The last remaining streetlight have blah blah blah. Okay, I got that. The last yet to be replaced by the sickening blue green hue of the future. Wow. I I bathe by bathe calm. Reading, air of the present but living in the past, the light flickers, I flicker back. Yeah, I get it, yes. We're, this is an option to click on it and see it, this and, you know, and like, she flickers back, that's nice, yeah. I'm sorry, I'm sorry, I have such terrible handwriting. Ah, she heard me. Is, is this game listening through my mic? Fuck! Is this happening yet? Is this happening? <laughs> Sorry, I have such a terrible. It's okay. I try my best to read it. What? I wasn't thinking that at all. I'm a such a liar. But it took you a long time to read. Oh god damn it! This the game was timing me. Ah, well, I just don't read script very often. Oh boy. Okay, this game is getting in my mind. 
What the fuck? <laughs> I actually think your handwriting is pretty. I said with my dick. Huh? That's a relief. Also, uh, also I like the poem. Even though it's short, it was really descriptive. It wasn't too short. I usually write longer poems. Not at all. I'm really glad you liked it. I'll be honest. Since it's our first time sharing, I wanted to write something a little more mild. Oh, it gets darker. I get it. Something easy to digest, I suppose. Oh, are you into ghosts? Why would you ask this? Oh, why? Why? Because it says ghosts. Are you into ghosts, Yuri? Oh, uh -huh. Actually, the story isn't about ghosts at all. Do you? Yes, you stupid. God damn it. This guy is an idiot. How you feel the need to read out loud rather than letting the viewers read it themselves? <laughs> really? You must have totally missed the point. Yes! Yes, you missed the point completely. Oh my god, I hate this character. Well, I suppose... Uh, well, I suppose you did only glance over it after all. You see, we're in and then we're out, then we're in again and then we're out. God damn it. We're such a dick. Literally. But remember that poets often express their own thoughts, feeling, and experience in their work. They usually do more than tell a simple story or paint a picture. In this case, perhaps the subject of the poem is only being symbolic symbolically compared to a ghost, lingering in her last remaining place of comfort, unable to let go of the past. Oh boy, and soon to be left with nothing. We are very depressed, aren't we? That's a lot of more solemn putting it that way, yeah. I hadn't even thought of that. Really? My god, this character's an idiot. Yes! That's impressive. Huh? Oh. It's nothing, really. Yours was impressive too, so... Nah, I, I, I'm just fucked up in the head. I just, don't, don't worry about it. If anything, I, <clears throat> if anything, I could probably learn a thing or two from you. Y you you think so? Yeah, of course. Ah. Oh, well, you know, um... I was really nervous about doing all this. But in the end, I enjoyed it. I'm going to keep doing my best for you, Luigi. Oh boy, we're in again. We're again. What's with the poros in the chat? <laughs> Did you give her some vitamin D? <laughs> my god. We are 40 minutes into this game. Yes. Nothing fucked up yet. Ah. Me too. Can I skip this bitches? Oh god damn it, I don't Can I go home? No? I'm clicking at the door as hard as I can. Ah, uh, alright. Sayori. <clears throat> Let's go with Sayori's boys. Let's mm. <clears throat> This is a good point, Luigi me! Are you sure it's your first time? Yes. Of course. It's not that good. Uh, am I that kind of guy who will be writing poems in his first time? <laughs> I guess you're right, man! But that's why it impressed me. Well, to be honest, I was afraid that you wouldn't do it seriously, you know. Or that you wouldn't write in one at all. <laughs> I'm really happy you just, just that you wrote one. <laughs> It reminds me of how you're really a part of the club now. Yeah, you dragged me in here. Not to mention the fact that I'm standing in front of you in the club room. I think it's... Uh, well, of course. I'm not really into it yet. But that doesn't mean I'll break my promise. <coughs> well, he's playing blind. He might miss something. I missed something? I guess I missed something. Well, that's the whole point. I'm playing... Every, every game that I play, I play it blind, dude. You're watching it blind, but so it do. Wait, what, what did I miss? Yeah, Skip was available before making the choice. DID I?! Ah, uh, alright. Well, we're, we're, we're already here, though. Okay. See? It's like saying before, Luigi. Deep down, you know I'm self result, you know? But now I gotta share everything with other bitches, though. It'll be, you know... If I were there, I would have to at that point. Trying new things like this for our... Trying new things like this for our people. 
There's something that only really good people do. Oh, you should have. Thank you, Say Sayori. I'm not sure if Yori sees the full picture of my motive here. I mean, I'm a teenager. Then again, I can't deny that she's part of the reason I joined. Knowing how much this means to her and all. Yeah! Yeah! And I'm gonna make sure you have lots of fun here, okay? Mm. Really? How much fun are we talking about? That will be my Thank you! Alright, I'm going to hold you to that then. <laughs> yeah! <laughs> <laughs> now you read my poem too, right? Right, 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 right! Don't worry, I'm really bad at this. I bet. <laughs> well, see, we'll see about that. Oh boy. Okay, this one is reasonable. Dear Sunshine, oh boy. The way you glow through my blinds in the morning, it makes me feel like you miss me. Kissing my forehead to help me out of the bed. Making me rub the sleepy f from my eyes. My god, I hate you. Are you asking me to come out and play? Are you trusting me to wish away a rainy day? I look above. The sky is blue. It's a, it is a, it's a secret, but I trust you too. If, I, if it wasn't for you... Uh, she's talking about me, isn't it? God damn it. I could sleep forever, but I'm not mad. I want breakfast. Okay, she's stupid, and she wants my dick. Got it. She's more dense than your character. Yes. But she's very direct in her writing. Sayori? This is just, uh, this is just a guess, but, um... Do you wait until this morning to write this? No! Mm. Just a little bit, Matt! You, you can't answer just a little bit. So, uh, yes or not, bitch! I forget to do it last night because I was, you know, watching anime, eating, uh, eating some nachos with some guacamole, and then I got me some, you know, burritos and... I'm fucking hungry! Well, at least that makes me feel a little better about myself. Don't be mean. I still try my best. Mm. Oh, yeah, your best. Not quite there, but yeah. I didn't mean to say that it was a Bad poem. Quotation marks. It came out nice, or how should I put it? Sounds just like you. Really? Me? Yeah. S especially that last line. I made eggs and toes. Ma. <laughs> <She's> <laughs> oh boy, she's more. Oh boy, bittersweet. Just a tip. Even though you were late to school. It's about to skip breakfast! Ah! Ah. I get all cranky and shit. <laughs> well, I guess there's no point in arguing. Anyway, thank you for showing me. <laughs> yeah, I'll show you a bunch of things. I gotta... okay, what, what was that? Never mind. Okay, this was so much fun! Monica's the best! Ah! Oh yeah, yeah, she's, she's definitely the best. I'm not gonna lie. I'm glad that we see the same thing here. But next time, I won't forget! And I'm going to write the best poem ever! Ah! Well, I guess I look forward to it. To whatever you write. Oh boy, you know what? Might as well. Might as well. You fucking do it. <clears throat> you, 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 you just... I should get her a helmet, right? <laughs> <laughs> You're killing me, Jerry. Alright, here's this bitch now. Yes, we're looking at each other. This is a good star. Talk. Oh, well, it's about what I expected from someone like you. Oh, you're a dick. That, that's, that's a little blunt. Well, oh, excuse me, princess. It's not like I say it was bad. Oh, it's just that I didn't evoke any emotions. So basically, it's not cute enough for your taste. Got it? What if I throw a, a, you know, a kitten in there or some shit? Oh, do you want to get smack? You wanna go? You wanna go? Mm, I'll pass, I'll pass, I'll pass. I'll pass. Oh, sigh. Who says sigh? Well, anyway, I guess I need to show you mine. <laughs> i show you mine, show me yours. Uh, oh. Not that you like it. 
Why did we sound like like is she, is she gonna whip her dick out? <laughs> bum, 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 plot twist. Oh boy, what is this? Eagles can fly. Monkeys can climb. I love the music, it goes so well with it. Crickets can leap. Horses can race. Owls can seek. Cheetahs can run. Eagles can fly. People can try. But that's about it. You were you were you were you were you were talking shit about mine. You feel dumber by having to read this? Yeah. You 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 were talking shit about mine. You You were talking sh mm, okay. Oh yeah. Oh, I told you that you weren't gonna like it. Ah, uh, don't put words in my mouth. I'm gonna like it just to make you wrong. I like it, yeah. Yeah, I like it. What about that, huh? Hmm? Fucking like it. What? Oh, oh, yeah, that's right, I liked it. Wanna fight about it? Just be honest, oh, oh, I am. I really am. Spiteful, but oh, yeah, I like it. Why are you so convinced that I wouldn't like it, bitch? Well, oh, because everyone's high school thinks that our writing has to be all sophisticated and stuff. Oh, oh. <laughs> Did she write it in a... <laughs> Did she write it with crayons? <laughs> Is she from the elementary school? <laughs> oh. So people don't even... So people think I'm... Uh, think... <clears throat> so people don't even take my writing seriously. Oh. But isn't the point of points for people to express themselves, you dingus? Your writing style wouldn't make your message any less valid. Just fucking write. Yes, exactly. Oh. I like when it's easy to read. But it, it hits you hard. Oh. Like in this poem. Oh. Then everyone around you do great things can be really just disheartening. Oh. So I decided to write about it. Oh. Yeah, I, 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 I can understand what she wrote. Okay, very childish, but I understand that she feels like she can't do as you know as as, as good as everybody else in the, in this club. She's supposed to be the first, first, first. That doesn't excuse that she's a first year. Okay. R Jerry says, "Really, I would have put her in negative years." <laughs> yeah, I understand. Oh, but the other nice things about simple writing is that it puts more weight on the wordplay. <laughs> Wordplay. Like, like I set up for a rhyme at the end, oh, but then he made it fall flat on purpose. Really? It was on purpose. You don't say. It helps bring up the feeling in the last line. Oh. So you did. I guess more went into it than I realized. Oh, that's what I. Well, that's what it means to be a pro. Oh, I'm glad you learned something. Oh. Didn't expect that from you. You're the youngest one here, didn't you? Oh, oh, oh. This is the young, young for the complexity of romance. Tell her to take her Crayola and take uh, take a hike. Wow, Mike, stop with the backup. <laughs> give her, give her constructive paper, construction paper, glue and glitter. <laughs> yeah, I guess not. I decided to humor her with that last comment. I don't really care how old everyone is. But if Natsuki is uh, feeling proud, then I won't take the ad away from her. I'm not that petty. Whew! Oh right, wait, we went through this shit. I guess that's everyone. I glanced around the room. That was a little more stressful than I anticipated. As I said, everyone is judging me for my mediocre writing abilities. Even if they're just being nice. There's no way my poem can stand up to theirs. Well, I love the self-confidence my character has. She can start by gluing her mouth shut. <laughs> Man, Emperor of Cheese. We're a little aggressive tonight, eh? Will I age an entire year? You <laughs> This is a literature, cl literature club, after all. I sigh. I guess that's why I ended up getting myself into. Across the room, Sayori and Monica are happily chatting. My eyes land on Yuri and Natsuki. Oh boy. Can one of them just leave? Meaning the pink one. Pink, take a hike. 
the gingerly exchanged sheets of paper, sharing their respective poem as they read it in tandem. I watched each of their expressions change. This is the worst matchup. This bitch is dark as shit. This is a preschooler. Nasty his eyebrows uh, from in frustration. Meanwhile, Yuri smiles sadly. Oh. oh, what's with this language? Uh, oh, um, um, did you say something? Oh, it's nothing. Nasuki dismissively returns the poem to the desk with, uh, with one hand. Oh, I guess you could say it's fancy. Oh, thank you. Yours is cute. Oh, they're gonna kill each other, isn't it? Can, can I throw a knife? No, no, no. Can I, can I just break a, 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 a stick and throw it in the middle of the room? Think of me of a... She's adorable, but she has a little too much aggressive spawn. What about the music, Mike? Is it too loud? Now I gotta take. Cute. Cute? Oh, what the fuck? What are you? What are you fuck, I'm talking about? Cute, man. Fuck. Oh, fuck you, bitch. Did you completely miss the symbolism or something? Oh. It's clearly about feeling of giving up. Oh. Uh, oh yes. Feelings of giving up. How can that be cute? Oh. Uh, I I know that. I just meant the language. I guess. I was trying to say something nice, because you know, kind of sucks. Huh? Oh? You mean you have to try to that hard to come up with something nice to say? Huh? Thanks, but it really didn't come out nice at all. Oh. <coughs> well. <coughs> well. Well, I do have a couple of suggestions. If I was looking for suggestions, I would have asked someone who actually liked it. Oh, that's not how it works. Come on. Which people did, by the way. Oh, so you liked it. And Luigi did too. Oh, oh don't bring me into this shit. You guys fight it out outside. I got nothing to do with this. Mm -mm, no, Siri. So based on that, I'm glad to give you some suggestions for, of my own. First of all... <clears throat> Excuse me. I appreciate the offer, but I spent a long time establishing my writing style. I don't expect it to change anytime soon. Unless, of course, I come across something particularly inspiring. Which I haven't yet. Mm! You make me sound like fucking Chayori! Oh! And Luigi like my poem too, you know? He even told- Oh boy, I'm in this- I'm in this fucking neck deep in shit right now. Last time I saw two girls in high school fight, one lost their shirt and the other their, their, their pants. Wow! It's up the heavy girls. What? Dude, stand up to the girl you love and stand up to- uh, Listen, love is a little too strong of a word. I just met this chick, dude. <laughs> um, he, he even told me he was impressed by it. Now I think it suddenly stands out. Oh, fuck me. Here we go. Oh! Oh, oh, I didn't realize you were so invested in trying to impress your new member, Yuri. Oh, oh boy, here we go. Eh? That is not what I, uh, um, you, you're, you're just, you in sense of as well. Maybe you're just jealous that Luigi appreciates my advice more than he appreciates yours. <laughs> I think I gave it the right voice. And how did you know he didn't appreciate my advice more? Oh! Are you that full of yourself? You fucking shit! I'm gonna fuck you up right now! <clears throat> um... No. If I was full of myself, I will, I will deliberately go out of my way to make everything I do overly cutesy. Oh, she- Oh, snap. Oh. Oh, snap. Oh, shit. Oh. Um... Um, 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 is everybody okay, ma? <laughs> well, oh, well, you know what? I was the one whose boobs magically grew a side bigger as soon as Luigi started showing up. Oh. Oh. Oh, we're going there. She's going there. Oh. <laughs> oh, boy. <laughs> I feel like I should break a bottle and shank someone. <laughs> 
Oh boy. Oh boy. Natsuki. Um, um, Natsuki, that's a little. Uh, this doesn't involve you. I, I don't like fighting, guys. <laughs> Suddenly, both girls turn towards me as. Oh, it's fuck me. I think they just noticed I was standing there. Why are you standing there? You should run. You should be out of there already, but you're still here. Fuck. Luigi? She, she's just trying to make me look bad. Oh, that's not true. She started it. If she could get over herself and learn to appreciate that simple writing is more effective, oh, then this wouldn't have happened in the first place. What's the point in making your opponents all convoluted for no reason? Oh, the minute she'll jump out of the reader. Out of the reader. Not force them to have to, to figure it out. Oh, help me explain that to her. Oh, no, you go fuck yourself. You are okay, but don't drag me either. Wait. There's a reason we have so many deep and expressive words in our language. It's the only way to convey express, uh, complex complex feelings and meaning the most effective. Avoiding them is not only un unnecessarily limiting yourself, it's also a waste. Do you understand that? Ah, oh, fuck me. I'm, I'm in this. I'm, more, I'm really deep in this. Oh, boy. <laughs> oh, boy. Well... Is the game gonna give me my first decision here? How did I get dragged into this fucking thing? It's not like I, I know anything about writing. But whoever I agree with, they'll probably think more highly of me. Oh, so. <laughs> yep, yep. We're not making decisions here. Fuck that. I'm not taking anybody's size. Phone a friend, yes. <laughs> Can I phone a friend? <laughs> uh, uh, bop. Wait, what did I click on? <laughs> I glance at me drying up my words I have in my mouth. So instead of turn, I turn to Yuri. Uh, Yuri? Hmm. Oh boy. But Yuri's expression is so defenseless that I can't bring myself to say anything to her. Oh, fuck my side. Say Yuri! Huh? What? Be useful for once in your fucking life and get me out of this. Yeah. Everyone's fighting is making Sayori uncomfortable. Yeah, look at her. Look at her poor, sad, sad, unintelligent face. You're making Sayori uncomfortable. Please. Calm the fuck down. For Sayori's sake. How can the two of you keep fighting when you know you're making your friend feel like this? Look at her. Look at that face. Look at that dumbfounded face. That looks that he cannot even... That she cannot even add two plus two. Look at her. Uh, Luigi. <laughs> Oh, well, that's her problem. This isn't about her. I agree. It's unfair for others to inject their own feelings into our complex. Oh, yeah, unless Sayori wants to tell Yuri what a stuck-up jerk she is, Bin. Oh, boy. She will never. It's your immaturity that has made her upset in the first place. Oh, let's go. Let's go. Oh, boy. We're free. I'm sorry, Sayori. You were a, a sacrifice that had to be made. Oh, excuse me. Are you listening to yourself? Oh, this is exactly why. Exactly why nobody likes you. Oh, boy. Stop! Natsuki, Yuri. <laughs> Way to throw your childhood friend under the bus. Oh, I'll do it again. I'll teach her not to ruin her poetry in a timely manner. <laughs> <laughs> you guys were my friends. Mm. I just want everybody to get along and be happy. Nah. My friends are wonderful people. <laughs> and I love them because of their differences. Nazuki forms. They're amazing because they give you so many feelings with just a few words. And Yuri's poems are amazing because they paint a beautiful picture in your head. 
Man! Everyone's so talented! I fucking suck! <laughs> so why are you- why are we fighting? Oh, because of- Well... Uh, also, Natsuki is cute and there's nothing wrong with that. And your boobs are the same as they always were. <laughs> Big and beautiful. I know it. I'll stare at them all the time. Fuck. I drink milk every day, but nothing's happening up here, okay? Look at her. Look at this bitch. She's fine, okay? <laughs> <laughs> um, Sayori? Are <laughs> you okay? Sayori stands triumphantly. Monica stands behind her with a bewildered expression. I'll make some tea. Yuri rushes off. I made the right choice. Natsuki sits down with a blank expression on her face, staring at nothing. So this is why Sayori is vice president. <laughs> I whisper to Monica. She nods in return. Be honest. I might come off a good leader. Ah, fuck, I skipped it! Damn it! I jumped the gun. Thank for the cookies, Cutter. Simple tone speech, Sayori. <laughs> but I'm not very good at with people. I couldn't even bring myself to interject. As present, that's kind of embarrassing of me. <laughs> nah, you're good. I threw that bitch under the bus, and I feel just fine. <laughs> it's not like I came. I can't blame you. I wasn't able to say anything either. But I used my imagination. And I come up with a solution that involves somebody else getting involved and me getting away scotch free. Remember, kids, always try to get somebody else involved and get scotch free. Natsuki is obviously threatened by your size, right? <laughs> well, I guess that just means Sayori is amazing in her own ways, isn't she? Sure, sure, you could say that. She might be uh, an airhead, but sometimes it's really suspicious that she knows exactly what she's doing. Mm hmm. Strike a pose! I see. Take a good care of her, okay? You don't tell me what to fucking do with that bitch. It will be. I would hate to see her get herself hurt. Oh, great. That makes two of us, uh, sure. You can count on me! Monica smiles sweetly at me, causing my stomach to knock. Such a genuine person really does make a good person, regardless of what she says. If I could only could get the chance to talk to her a little more, right? Right? Am I, am I right? Am I right? Am I right? Am I right? <coughs> okay, everyone. It's just about time for us to leave. How do you all feel about sharing poems? I don't know. I don't know. It was a lot of fun! <laughs> well, I say it was worth it. Oh, I was all right. Well, mostly. Bridget, how about you? Yeah, I, s I say the same. It was just like, I, I mean, nobody died. It was a neat thing to talk about with everyone. Awesome. Awesome. In that case, we'll do the same thing tomorrow. Go fuck yourself. Maybe you'll learn something from your friends too. So your poems will turn out even better. Oh, fuck me. Oh, come on. I think to myself, I did learn a little more about the kinds of poems everyone likes. With any luck, that means I can at least do a better job impressing those I, uh, I want to impress. Hint, hint, notch, notch, that's a hint, dumbass. This is how you write the poems to impress other chicks, got it. No, no, I know to myself with a newfound determination. Ready? Meh! Ready to walk home? Oh, fuck. Sure, let's go. <laughs> Sayori beams at me. It truly has been a while since Yori and I have spent this much time together. I can't really say I'm not enjoying. I can't say I'm not. Uh, yeah, I kind of changed a little bit. Not enjoying it either. Yeah, so much for Spooky Mondays, right? I'm still waiting for the plot twist. Sayori, How about what happened earlier? <laughs> what do you mean? You know, between Yuri and Natsuki. Does that kind of thing happen often? No, 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 We know your history with traffic. Oh. Oh, and leash. Oh. That's really the first time I've seen the- Oh, they're fighting because of me. But my character can't realize that. How much do I have to wait? 
Because it's almost five hours of stream. I promise they're both wonderful people. You, you don't you don't hate them, do you? No, I don't hate them. I mean You're here. That puts things in perspective. I just want I just wanted your opinion, that's all. I can see why they make good friends with you. Phew! You know, we, we, it's nice that I get to spend time with you in the club. But I think seeing you get along with everyone is making me... If that one makes me the happiest, man! I think everyone really likes you too. You know? Like, you know, like they're getting all you know, excited and shit. Now, yeah, Mike, we're an hour in. <laughs> That's, uh... <laughs> Every day is going to be so much fun! Man! Oh, boy. It looks like Sayori still hasn't caught out onto the kind of situation I'm in. Sure, being friends with everyone is nice, but um, she really needs to stop there. Well, just have to see what the future holds, Sayori. I pat Sayori in the shoulder. Said that more to myself than to her. But it's easy to use Sh Sh Sayori as an internal model or something. Okay! Okay! Yeah! Let's do this. Oh boy. Yeah, don't spoil it, but um <clears throat> it's gonna be five hours of stream. So I'm going to write this shit and we're gonna call it quits till next week. So let's get on with this poem, shall we? Let's go. Technically, the only one. Because. Sure. Okay, I forgot she loved mystery. Marriage, universe, holiday, chicks, joy, insight, climax. Let's go. Rainbow, nightgown, breath, pain, fluffy, philosophy, existence, treasure, lake. Existence. Skipping, adventure, jumpy, tragedy, laugh, spinning, crimson, swimsuit, analysis, aura, blanket, graveyard, calm, happiness, awesome, smile, pink, graveyard, rose, friends, waterfall, her, wonderful, vibrant, forgive, desire, sire. Whoa, 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 what was that? The fuck happened to the game? Okay. 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 Puppy, grief, precious, atone, shame, disarray, explode, boop, hurt. Disarray. Let's go. Fantasy, fashion, fashion. Damn it. Clouds, kitty, twirl, dance, vitality, sunset, sing, intellectual, nature, destiny. Encouragement, imagination, it looks like whirlwind, captives, bunny, capable. I'm curious. Welcome back. I'm I'm really curious. I wanna see who I'm going for this one. I need to know. I'm doing this for science. I, I need to know. Oh wow, okay, never mind. Alright. Okay. Alright. Okay. We learned something that we didn't wanna learn. I, I, we learned something, I, man, fuck science, man. <laughs> okay, clumsy daydream, af after image, sensation. Ho ho ho, hair sucks, contamination, judgment, determined name. I need to know. Science. Oh wow, okay. Disaster, charm, cage, tears. Fickle, sticky. Sticky. Oh, ew. Loud, empty, peaceful, special, secretive, shiny, sadness, whisper, cheer, candy. Yeah, whisper. Oh my god. Death. 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 Playground, essence, uncanny, whistle, misfortune, tenacious, journey, fear, defeat. Oh, essence. I saw anime this time. Your boobs are so big to contain so much of. 
<laughs> there was some. <laughs> oh boy. Papa. Entropy. Oh, we already know this. An ending. We nailed this one. I know it. All right. We finished the poem. We know where we're going with this. I know that they passed this entire of the club. All right. Question, Mike. Listen to me. And listen closely. Is something going to happen right now? Or can this wait till next Spooky Monday? Answer now. Another day passes, and it's time for the club's meeting already. i got gotten a little more uh, comfortable here over the past couple of days. <laughs> Entering the club room, the usual scene greets me. It can't wait? Alrighty then. Alright, we rode the most... Pessimistic. Darkest. Suicidal poem. Are we gonna get this chick next week? This is being a weird spooky, spooky Monday. I'm trusting people on this one. I heard people talking about it though, so I'm gonna say that yes, probably this is just building up to something, you know, something bad, something really bad. So, I mean, I watch Madoka Maga, and I know how cutesy things can turn really, really bad, really, really quick. I mean. I don't mean to, you know, there's some spoilers, but episode 3, shit hit the fan in Madoka Maika. So, let's just hope that next episode, we finally reach deep within the plot twist that is Doki Doki Bullshit. I think this is a good cliffhanger for next week, right? Alright, we have some cliffhangers. We wrote a nice little poem, so everybody, thank you for watching. We'll continue this tomorrow. Oh wait, let me save just in case. Save. Uh, right here. Yeah! Right the fuck there! Alright. So, uh, main menu. Are you sure you want to return to the main menu? This will lose on safe progress. Yeah, we did. Alright. Well, there they are. There are the chicka chicks. Yeah! 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 Go fuck yourself. Whatever. So, I save. I did save, right? Hold on, let me check. Yeah, it's right here. Alright, I save. Alright, don't worry. Okie dokie with the doki dokies. I understand. Next week, Emperor of Cheese, I'll be here with more spooky shit. Everybody else, thank you for watching. If you guys were here for uh, doki doki bullshit, literature club, well, it's over. Because it has finally ended. So, game over, people. Good night. I hope it, the game doesn't want to quit. The game is. The game crash. The the game the game crash. <laughs> well, that's a good way to say good night. Alrighty then. So everybody, thank you for watching. I'll be here next Monday with more spooky stuff. If you guys are here for the spooky stuff, we start every Monday at eleven. That's Eastern time, the U.S. time. Uh, tomorrow is Stealthy Tuesday. We start also at eleven. We're gonna be playing Metal Gear, The Phantom Pain, and then Alien Isolation. We're so close to finishing Alien Isolation, so if you guys wanna watch that, come and watch, you know, you're gonna see me die to an alien. So, yes, Emperor of Cheese, the stream is over. Now get out, yes. <laughs> so, tomorrow, Stealthy Tuesdays. Uh, I'm looking forward to the end of Alien. I'm pretty sure I'm really close. And after that, I'll see you guys on Friday, because I don't stream Wednesdays and Thursdays. So, don't forget. Spooky Mondays, every Monday at 11, Stealthy Tuesday, tomorrow at 11 as well. I'll be here, and till then, please, enjoy the following video. Have a good night. Bye-bye.